Hi, I'm Rose. I go to Seneca College. I study business management, the degree program. I'm kind of in the like last hall of this program, trying to get it done. I live at the Seneca Residence Newham campus because I go to Seneca Newham. Um, so today I am actually going to be checking my winter 2023 grade and then also my fall 2022 grade so the last two semesters of my grades um i remember checking them just like briefly just to see if i passed everything um like after the fall semester ended just so i can know like what to take in the winter um but i don't remember um so i'm just gonna like check it now kind of like react to it as well i also and I breakfast and I'm not gonna have time to have breakfast today because I start work soon. Not soon, but like I have to like get going at 3, 3.30. Um, so I'm already on the Seneca Blackboard website and everything. I am on Seneca Student Home. So I'm just gonna go to few grades. I'm gonna go to fall. Actually, let me get something first. I'm gonna try this yogurt and raspberry popcorn bar. President's choice. Mm. I always love like yogurt bars. Um, so I'm gonna go to fall 2022. Oh my gosh, my term GPA. Like so that term is a 1.9. Academic standing probation. <laughs> That's so bad. Now I'm gonna get two. Okay, so I was taking one, two, three, four classes. So I was taking BMT 540, BMT 550, INS 301, LSO 560. <coughs> um, let's check what BMT 540 is. So that was the, so this was my, one of my um, program classes that I had to take for the program. So it wasn't a gen, ed or gen education course or anything. So it was business to business marketing. Um, let me just see. So this was the class on Mondays that I could go to in person or like view it online. I remember I went to the class like maybe once in person. Um, so let me check my grade for this. Or let me see class details. Actually, let me go back. Um... Wait, how do I see the grade? Oh, okay. So this was actually my highest grade in this fall semester, so I got B plus. I honestly like my memory is so bad I don't even like remember like this far back, like this semester really. I remember I was working like 40 hours. I wasn't really happy at the residence because I was living with them. Anyways, I, I had a roommate situation. Um, and then I was working like 40 hours. So I was like barely at home or like barely like focusing on school or anything. But I got a B plus, that's really good. And then let me check the BMT 550. So this was my nonprofit management class. Again, this was for Oh, this was online and asynchro. Um, I remember I had this prof like in this class. I had her like before in like other classes. And she's very, I don't know. I just, I, didn't, I never knew well in her classes. Um, and this one was like the same thing. She's, she's fine as a teacher. And, I mean, as a professor and everything, but like I just never do good in her class. Um, so this um let me check yeah so i actually i got an f 
which I remember like looking back at this like mark in like I think December when the grades came out for like the fall 2022 I was like oh my gosh like why I remember we had like group like group work and it was like a big chunk of your marks and I remember you had to be on Microsoft Teams but I think it was Microsoft Teams it was like a different app and you couldn't communicate through WhatsApp you couldn't communicate through like I think it was Blackboard or anything else but that I think Microsoft Teams and I have no problem like downloading it or anything but I'm just like so used to like doing group work like through like assigning stuff through WhatsApp and like having a group messaging system there and I remember like the people in my group like they me and this other there was a group of four and like me and this other guy in the class like we didn't like have microsoft teams we didn't know the communication was through there and it was like so confusing and then like the other two group members they would like do all the group work and then they would like submit it and they wouldn't like discuss it with us um even when i did check microsoft teams like they wouldn't like discuss it with us really and they would just like submit it and it would, i don't know that group would just the communication was so bad and yeah, so I didn't do good in that class. I remember I missed like group assignments just because like I didn't like the communication like for that class was just so it was awful. Um, so yeah, I ended up failing it. I don't actually end up failing it unless if there's like a good reason or like I don't know. I normally always pass, but this was a surprise to me. Um, so I actually had to take this class again in the winter or this winter. Um, so we'll go to that later on, but let me check the next course, INS 301. So this was a gen ed course that I had to take. And, um, so it was Intro to Cognitive Sciences. I remember this class, it was always at 8 a.m. and like, I am not a morning person at all. So I would go, to, I would attend the class sometime online and in, in my bed and then I'd fall asleep like halfway through. My camera was never on, but like I feel like the professor would always like ask me, Oh bros, what do you think? Or like ask me like questions when I would like fall asleep. So I was like confused because like my camera was never on, but I'm like, like, is he able to like see? I don't know, but anyways, it was just a like, gen ed course. The like instructions for this, like all the assignments were like very like the wording was very like wordy, so it was like hard to understand. So I had to like decode all the instructions. It was just like hard English to understand, so I I'm surprised I didn't even like I had to like decode the instructions and I didn't even know like what the instructions were talking about like so it was hard to like do the assignments but let me check the grade for that so I got a C like it was, it was hard and then LSO 560 so this was the global financial crisis class so this was another gen ed course because you have to take like I think two gen ed courses or I don't even know um this one was our hard class too just because like the I don't know, it was just like hard, like, it was a lot of information, um, but it was actually like, there was group work, and like, the group work was a little bit easier, um, so let me check this, so I got a C, so, like, not the worst, but not the best, so yeah, that was my fall 2022 grades, let me check winter 2023 so like from january to april so my grade because i only took one class um my schedule i was supposed to have a full schedule but like i was dealing with like student advisors and like nobody was getting back to me and then like someone told me a different answer and then it was so i ended up having to just take one class which was the class that i failed in um fall 2022 so the non-profit class bmt 5550 this one I had with a different professor, which he was like a lot better. Like, I don't know, I just did a lot better in his class and I was actually more engaged. Again, like I wasn't like, like studying all the time. I wasn't, I don't know, I, I need to like start putting my all into my classes, but. Um, so my grade, or let me see the term GPA 2.0, which I went up. Um, academic standing, still probation. And then my grade is a C, so like I passed. Um, the group work for this one was a lot better. I had like, I actually liked the group members like a lot, just because our communication was very good. Um, we communicated through like WhatsApp and yeah, the girls in the group were really good. Mm, I, I remember like I attended some of the lectures too. I was like engaged. Um, 
Yeah, I remember like I actually like a, I like the professor. Um, I remember like I would like participate during like group discussions and stuff. So it was actually a good class. I just and it was in the evening too. It was pretty odd. It was like let me check. Seventeen ten. So that would be. So that would be 510 to 755, 1855 or 655? Yeah, 655. It was pretty odd. So like 510 to 7 p.m. So that was like a later class. Um, I remember I was like work like in the, in the afternoon to like 4, I think it was 430. And then I get back here at residence because it would take me half an hour. And then I'd attend class. Sometimes I sometimes I wouldn't because after a while, like it was just like group present presentations. And then like you would have to do an individual reflection on it, on it like due Monday. Um, and the class was on Thursday, so I had like Friday, Saturday, Sunday to do it. So yeah, um, so yeah, that was a fun class. So yeah, that was all of me checking my grades for the fall and winter 2023 terms, so the last two semesters. Um, I'm going to be doing the summer semester full term again for me. The course load is smaller because I'm like, I'm a, I have permanent disabilities, so I don't take as many classes at like per semester. So it's like less for me, but still full course load for me. Um, so I'm excited for that. I also got to get my gen ed course. I got to like, ask my student advisor about that to enroll me in another one. Um, but yeah. So yeah, with that being said, I'll see you guys later.